can I be totally honest with you, when I heard baggy pants were coming in, I thought, oh no, I'm too little for baggy pants. But you know what? We know how to nail it. So just watch. We've got three outfits each today and a special guest look. She's hiding behind there. <laughs> and yes, so we Nat have Tucker from Make It Look Easy. Yes, well done. <laughs> they said I wasn't going to remember that. Yeah. But guess what? I did. Because number one, she's actually our friend. So the, the Make It Look yes. Easy part comes after that. But maybe you can give everyone an entry. You're like a co colour queen, colour yeah, expert. Yes, yes colour queen. queen. Boss of Your Wardrobe is my program and my company is called Make It Look Easy, which Faye will never be able to remember because no, of everything else long. that we do. <laughs> do it, is, it is too long. It is too long. But yeah, hey guys, I'm Nat Tucker and I do like to make it look easy. And today we're going to be showing you how we like to wear our wide leg pants. All right, shall we start? Can I start? You oh, can. I've got to start for a reason because I'm looking like a movie star in these glasses. No, I'm not a movie star. I have a migraine. So the bright lights, I thought, no, don't risk it. But you know what? It does make my outfit look sensational. Have a look at this. New pant, new top. I've got to, I've got to unzhuzh. This is how it looks when I've nailed it. This is unzhuzhing. I still like unzhuzhing, by the way. Oh, unzhuzhing is great. It has this elastic bottom, so it stays blues on it. I know, it's a very 70s word. Do you know that word, Nat? Yeah, yeah, blues I do. On. You know what it is, though, Faye? Like, if you imagine that's someone really tall, right, with a longer torso, yeah, like that's that. going to actually... Look at that. Without, it's yeah, it's going to... amazing, but yeah. I'm short. Yeah, absolutely. It's I'm absolutely going to fall perfectly. And that's what I find with it. It's just like the tallies are loving this. And then the shorties just tuck it in. Yeah. They are. And it's look at the length so of the pants. It's so multi-purpose. Yeah, I've got these big shoes... That's why, but they are quite long. But for me, because I'm a shorty, I'm just going to have to tuck them all in like I did. I feel like I'm going to just a half, half tuck. tuck. Yeah. yeah, just a half tuck. It yeah. you gorgeous. Wow, look at that. that. Yeah, look at yeah. the back. Yeah. I love that. So much you can do with this. Can we just uh, talk about the fabric a little bit? Because yes, it's, it's like, easy. it is like liquid, liquid leather. I'll come right up close. You can see the texture and the sheen. It is not shiny like the old style shiny, it's just a sheen like leather and that's mm. what's so spectacular about it. And it is a baggy pant, but the pleats are very flat across the front even though it's an elastic waist for comfort. Can, see it? Can you see that? Yeah, under that belt and just easily adding a belt or not. It really doesn't matter because it looks good regardless because that's quite flat there. And of course side pockets and a fabulous new leg. It is really a bit of a um, barrel leg but it's not that noticeable you know no. because it collapses and it's nice and soft and floaty and who wouldn't want that mm -hmm. and I think that's the secret to a baggy pant just a fantastic cut yeah can I, I just mention something about the arms on this top is oh, that yeah. it actually casts a shadow down the arms so it gives a lovely shadow down the arms for those who don't like their arms this upper part of the arm actually falls into the shade so it's extremely flattering for those who don't like to cover their arms they'll find that this top will work really amazing. Mm -hmm. And you can see that you can't see much under there and it covers it just enough so that you get to feel quite sexy, especially if you're bringing your waist in or not or front tuck or whatever because it gives you shape. But that over the shoulder look is to die for. It is such a brilliant cut. And of course the high neck too, it just has a soft drape mm -hmm. and a zip at the back. So if you're worried about your hairstyle, your lippy, your glasses, whatever, don't worry, it's got the zip, we've got you covered. Mm -hmm. And it still has quite a close look around the neck. And you know what? I actually don't have it. Where is our new necklace? Because oh, that one, that one yes. part. Okay, I'll show you. Because being such a high neck, um, actually, it wasn't what I was going to say. What I was going to say was the trend is um, to wear a necklace over the top of a high. Yeah, I love that. A high uh, top, so especially you can't create your V-neck. Yeah, so you create your V-neck, but just because. There we go. I've got, I've, with these dark glasses, of course, I can't see anything. Yeah. Oh, it might be a little bit too... Um... I need the extender. Yeah, do you want it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, Nat. I'm no, sorry, no, no, but, no, 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 you're fine. I'm, you know, cutting you out because you're... It is you're hard for Faith. She it. has got a, mm -hmm. hey, she's got a yeah. migraine and she's mm -hmm. still committed to doing this live and I think that's just awesome. Isn't she sweet? I wouldn't miss anything. Oh, I've got she's FOMO, so I've got to be in it. Yeah, I've got to be in it. So I've seen a fab Thank you. You're a sweetheart. <laughs> that only says nice things. Yeah. <laughs> not like me. Not like, yeah, like, Lauren just gives it to me, but not Nat. She's I'd just say, nice yeah, no, don't like to me. me. Yeah, okay, so new necklace. Oh my God, I'm, can I just like, have a laugh? Glasses, earrings. Yeah. This necklace. Oh, no, 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 no. oh my God. Hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. Let me add this as well. Yes. What else can I add? <laughs> the point was, I was going to show you this new necklace. Maybe get rid of the belt. 
no, just for this yeah. one, just turn it <laughs> around. Sure? No, I think she's just turn it around. Just like that. You just yeah, pretend just, that's your belt. Just turn it around. Oh my god, I just had visions of who was that guy who used to be in that show in the sixties or seventies and used to always wear lots of chains around the neck. Oh my Is that god. Mr. T? Mr. T! Yeah. Mr. T! Mr. T! Yeah. Yeah. Mr. T. Oh, I had visions of Mr. T for a second there. Don't worry, I've got more style than that because I'm not going to do this all together. I just want to make a point of that necklace. <laughs> so funny. Oh, oh I think you're adorable, Faye. Thanks oh. for that. Now, I want to chat to you about these because like Faye, I always felt, oh, no, I'm not going to do wide leg pants. I'm very small and I thought they might swap me. But these pants are absolutely amazing. They have got that wide elastic at the waist which actually brings in and gives a lovely hourglass shape while the rest of the fluid fabric falls. Now I'm wearing a size 10. I like to wear these nice and high. And when you wear a sneaker with laces, it gives a ladder effect to make you actually seem like you've got a very slim leg under such a beautiful fluid loose pad. Now, I love a half tuck with this gorgeous high-waisted wide elastic pad so you can see the vest at the front there and then it has a coming off to the side there with the vest vests are the biggest thing so start wearing your vest in this fantastic kind of more let's say corporate -y kind of feel back with your more evening slinky pants mixed up with a street sneaker <gasps> Faye you'd be hating this the street sneaker Favorite hey, sneaker. I love it. I love it. Hey, Nat, can I ask, how tall are you? Okay. And did you have the pants altered? Now, the can, can everyone tell me how tall I am? The bays will be telling me. I think I'm 100 and seven centimetres. Okay. They will let me know. Um, I'm pretty sure I'm that. I'm very short. What are you? I'm five you're, foot two. Yeah, you're, fi you're five foot three and a half from memory. Yeah, you are. Okay, that. okay, Which there we go. Long. And they're a bit long. There you we know, go, there we go. Now, another tip I'd like to give you about these vests as well is if you do find that your bra shows, I'm wearing a size 10, um, all you have to do is go for a coloured bra. So if you go for a coloured bra, it's purposeful to have your bra showing. So it actually looks really cool. So don't panic about that. Or if you're a lacy kind of girl, really go for it. Go for a full on beautiful lace bra. These things are expensive. We should really put them on show. Yeah, true. Don't you agree? Love that. Yeah, I totally agree. Totally. All right, now next up. Now I've gone for the widest of the wide leg pants. You can't get much wider than this. They almost look like a skirt, but they are a pant. I'm wearing um, a size eight. These are called our wide leg collot. I think these are in gold and the fabric kind of has this beautiful marble finish. And the key to this is they are really, really drapey. Like they said, the key to wearing a really beautiful wide leg pant is to get something that just fits and falls beautifully. And these have the elastic in the back. I've done them with a point. Now I'm only five foot two. They actually are meant to be cropped, but on me they're full length. So on most other people, you will have that length about there which as you can see already it actually looks so good like that where they're meant to be but somehow these kind of get away with being long as well then i've got this new top on um if there's a few ways you can wear this right so what i've done is i've just done this is what it looks like if you really need a v-neck i'm loving this color combo too do you like oh, that i love that color yeah combo. so it's good totally actually i love it like this so you can just wear it down which is when you show off the v-neck i also just have on a little bra it's a little crop top bra from cotton on body um, and I love it because it has a really skinny, discreet, discreet strap. Oh, that's a tongue twister. Um, then you can do this, have a bit of a loose tie if you want to, or you can go all the way up to the neck and leave that peekaboo. And instead of having the bits, you can have them dangling, but I kind of like them tucked in. Yeah. Just, you know, whatever you have a bit of a tongue that you're not overly excited about, the hanging oh, out yeah, good idea. might just work. Yeah, good but idea. You know what? It, it just gives you a little bit of cover if you're not into that day. If you've got a bloaty day or something. You yeah, know, true. Like, or if it's your shape, you know. And then the last thing you can do, you can actually go around to the back, tie it at the back. You've got the keyhole in the front. Nice. And then you can leave them dangling. My and then one more. Hammy. One more, one more. The last thing you can do is tie it in a little bow. I find that this is more like your very feminine kind of, Soft and pretty. It looks great with denim jeans. How cute is it? Yes, because yeah. you've got the yeah, polar yeah. opposites. And, and I love it it's with cute. the bra straps yeah. as well. Yeah. I think it's a great way to show off bra straps. Yeah. 
and having a different colour bra strap to the top. Yeah. Looks good, yeah. Beautiful, honey, Thank I love you. it. And not only that, can I just talk about the points with your bag of pants, or did you already do that? No, that looks sensational. These are no, Charles just and Keith. Oh, really? Yeah, we bought them when we were away. Oh, right. Okay. They're, really, they're, they're like strangely comfortable. Really comfortable. Really yeah. comfortable. Well, they're flat. They should be. Well, I know, but even, you know, sometimes they rub. Yes, I okay. can. Rubby bits. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The front, Charles no and Keith have got some good shoes, yeah. I've got to say. Cool. Anyway, you look gorgeous, darling. Okay, well, thank you. Do you want to do a belt? No. No. No, I want you no. more. Hang on. A gold bag, a gold chain, the no, gold. I don't want to be tiara. Mr. T today. Right? Okay. I love <laughs> gold Mr. T. Not today. <laughs> um, I've decided to swap my pant for this bag of pant. It has, um, again, a bit of a barrel leg. I'm into barrel legs at the moment. So it's fabulous. Very flat front. Notice that. And of course, the belt um, hides your tum again if you just hang your belt like that. It just attracts. That's all it does. And it gives you a vertical line in any case. And these pockets. So it's a nice bag leg. Notice the fluid fluidity, couldn't say that in a hurry, yeah. of the pan. And I've just decided to put it with there's something showing here. Yeah, no, just put that down there. Okay. okay. With um, um, a, a, a lust cami. Reverse, though. I'll show mm -hmm. you the back. So my tip is a bag pan, wear it with a tight top. If you can, I mean, a pear shape would really rock an outfit like this because they can do something tight on the bottom and um, still flaunt their fabulous figure with a baggy pant. So I'm not even going to say much about this. This is it. So any fitted or, or smaller top tucked in, showing off your waist and your hip with a baggy pant is awesome. I love the colour combo too. Oh, it's a brilliant colour combo. Yeah. <laughs> Rose and mint. These pants actually called mint. Somebody asked me, they said they couldn't find them. Oh, but okay. it's a mint colourway rather than chartreuse, even though it might look like it on the screen. Show? No. Well, no, we probably we call them mint. We, go, we just go simple old, you know, yeah, that's yeah. very exotic. Yeah. We, look, we like to make it very simple here so everyone here understands it. There you go. Yeah, that's mint. it. Mint. It's yummy. It's, 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 it's doesn't love mint. mint. Yeah, Mint's yeah, great, yeah. right? Now, I've got a casual tee um, back with the very fluid. This is kind of like a glass of champagne. That's what I'm wearing there. Oh. So the casual tee. Now, what I love about this tee is the actual hardware at the waistline because it does actually hang beautifully over this wide elastic. So that kind of just, and it also goes, look at my waist, look at my waist, look at my waist. See that? Yeah, I love that. Super cute. And such a cool way to wear what could be actually a very dressy pant just every day. Exactly. Yeah. Should I grab the bag, Lauren? Yes. Okay, let's grab the Mr. bag. Mr. T. It. All right. Mr. So T. We should call that Mr. T. Bag. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I love that. There we go. That, that would be gorgeous. Now, the reason I have added the bag is because I have got two points of casual on at the moment, which is my t shirt and my sneaker. So I'm balancing it with two points of oh. the glam. Clever. Normally, gorgeous. I would swap out my shoes when I'm wearing this t shirt and these pants, mm. but I'm adding the bag instead. Yeah, so that's that. how you can do it too. Love that. Okay, so now I want to play with a few proportions, and I've done a little trick here, which I know people are going to be like, I wouldn't do that, but let me tell you, if you're short, you might want to listen up very closely. So this top normally, that's where it's going to fall. So you can see on me, it's stunning if you're average height or tall, all right? But with a really wide leg pant, it's chopping me at a part of the body that looks a little bit wide, and I look like a bit of a box. Nat calls it a fridge. Nat, do I look like a fridge? I look like a fridge. So, Faye showed you guys how to do a front tuck. If you need to, this is going to be different for everyone. If I have my ankles on show, I know it doesn't look very natural the way I'm holding it up, but suddenly everything changes almost. You just have to define your body. I'm not defining anybody. Even my neck is covered. So, if I did a front tuck, that would definitely work. That looks really nice, right? But... What if I don't want to do a front tuck? So what I'm doing is I'm actually, there's a bit of elastic here because it's actually like a balloon hem top and it's stretchy and then it cinches in. It's, it's still loose underneath, but it's designed to just hold the fabric up. I'm going to put the elastic just above my bust so I'm oh, getting yeah. a really croppy look. I love that. Do you that. like that? Love and the that. pants are so high-waisted. Like, my belly button is there, and all my, like, stretched-out bits are under my belly button. That's where it's really gone wrong, under the belly button. So you can't see anything. So if I just accidentally show a slither of skin, which I won't because, you know, when you're looking up at me a little bit, our phones are lower than our eye line. Um, so a child might see a slither of skin, but everyone else won't. But if you did, it's just showing that really nice part because it, gravity's just pulled it all down. It's all underneath the belly button. Up here is... And I love this. Love I love the colour combo too. And I love a little bit of... A slither. A peekaboo. Yeah, a little peekaboo. 
In fact, I think we could wear it like that. Yeah, I and it's still stay to one one budge, one budge, not yeah. under the bra. Yeah, yeah but I do happen. still like it. Like as a front tuck, if just for, you know, if you're just not quite ready for the full. Love it. Isn't yeah. that cute? Yeah, yeah. so cute. Yeah. Really yeah. nice. Yeah. So cute. Looks fabulous. Love okay. it. And love that combination too, by the way. The yeah, sensation. same. Um, okay, so now I've swapped um, the top for a loose top rather than a fitted top, still with a baggy pant, but of course with a front tuck and button up to the neck. This is the jacket, the new release today too, by the way. It's a bit of a denim look and it's still combined with um, the, the liquid leather look. Just show you. I call it the patchwork jacket, I think. The cool thing about that jacket is it's like off of a denim jacket, you assume that it's denim fabric, but for it to be such a beautiful, soft fabric, just such a great... Or Very luxe. Old casual and luxe. Yes. Yeah. It luxe and the buttons make it luxe too. Now, what I want to show you too is that what I've done, I've reversed the belt so that the side that I've tucked in can show off the belt hanging down. Um, it was just short, by the way, short little hanging down bit. It's still okay. Um, yeah, so it sort of all sits neatly. You don't, you don't want to be tucking this side in because it's the, it's the outer side of the jacket. You want to tuck the side with the actual buttons on because that's the underside, so it's all very neat when you wear it. And this just covers a little bit of the tummy if you want, but it's still a very slimming look. And you can see that uh, I have an elongated leg by doing a bit of a front tuck. This is a fabulous look. Don't need to put anything else, although you can actually put something under your collar. Maybe I'll do that. Of course she's going to do that. that. <laughs> that's it. Yeah, I'm not going to let it go without it. Got to make it extra. Got to make it extra. Yeah, I'm the extra girl around here. You've noticed. Extra, extra, extra. <laughs> Read all about it. Uh, yeah, well, I, I love extra. And why not? Why you not? Know? Why not? Why, why not? do extra? Okay. Do you help me? Yeah, yeah. I've got, actually, let me well, extend probably, it. I probably don't need that. No, I don't think you don't. Yeah, when it's a shirt collar and under a shirt collar, you might not need the extender. I just do it because, you know, again, I'm extra. But Lauren's going to help me here because I don't have my glasses on. I can't see what I'm doing. And look at that. Yeah, nice. Would I do that? Not with these glasses, but without the glasses. Oh, no, I think it's really cute. You do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah I, I think that's that. nice. I'll yeah, it's like definitely that. my personality. Like I said, the glasses are a little bit unusual because you wouldn't wear sunglasses inside. Although maybe I would. They would. Yeah, she would. would. <laughs> yeah, she would. Okay, Absolutely. yeah, would. Okay, so we're back with our gorgeous pants. I've pulled them up higher. I've tucked in further, left the back hanging out for that gorgeous waterfall look all down the back as if I've spilled a glass of champagne down my back. I love yeah. using that term, as you know. Now, this combination is a beautiful skin tone combination back with a dark neutral of the navy. So very feminine, mixed with a bit of masculine, kept the street sneakers on with the laces. So this is a great little look all together as well. And with this look, I'll then add a more casual bag of which- Do you have one? We don't have. No. Not here right now. But, but you can imagine, it? just imagine. Yeah, we'll find a bag. There's <laughs> going to be a bag here somewhere. Got to finish. But this is a great everyday look, but also going out. So um, you could over the top go glam. If I was wanting to keep a more going out vibe, I could add that as well to take it to that way. Faye's found me a casual bag, so I'm gonna pop that on. I don't know about the colour. That's alright. Oh, I don't know if the colour works, but it's just all, show it's that it has. It has. So, oh, yeah. Yes. Casual yeah, vibe. Yeah. There we go. Super Got easy. Got a vibe. I feel like a, like a leopard print bag would look really cool with this outfit. Yeah, too bad. We don't have a leopard print bag. I know. Bag. I, I do, do actually. Sorry, I do. I do. I'll divide. Well done. I just didn't think it was. I thought it was a bit casual. Oh, not casual enough, but it's okay. Oh, okay. Well, mate, what do I know? Let's do it all. Let's try. Yeah, I like the cross yeah, I think that's cool. Yeah, a bit more casual. Really nice. You're so tan with I'm sorry, I can't get it out. Don't worry. Too that's alright, this is fine. Anyway, you get the idea. So, yeah, really mix it up. Bring in a bit of casual when you've got your glam with it. And it's a great little mix, but wow, love these pants. Yeah, so cute. Alright, my last tip is always just add a vest. Now, this is our split hem vest. It is a size 10, so it's one size too big. I do wear this vest all the time with my baggy pants, but this one's making me look a little bit out of proportion. So if I have it left out, that's the vibe. But all I need to do is add a little bit more length to my legs. I'm looking a little bit too perfectly halved. I need like some longer legs, shorter torso. So all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use this bit that's at the bottom 
and I'm actually going to tuck it in. Now, this is the long bit. So, again, if you are taller than me, which most people are, you, you're not going to need to worry about this. So I've tucked in that bottom bit. A little bit how Nat had at the start. I'm still getting that angled line. I'm still getting that really cool, funky kind of, like, artsy, very creative look. But I've just given my leg a little bit more length. Nice. Beautiful. Cute. Cute, so yeah. Cute. And I love this yeah. combo. Yeah, me too. It's like print on print, but they really go well yeah. together. Yeah. Not too much. Are we done? Yeah. yeah, we're done. I hope we inspired you to wear a bag of pants or at least try it. Um, and yeah, we'd love to see your posts anyway. Bye for now. We're probably going to have to go and it up. Sorry. Nat won't be here tomorrow. No. no. Sure. I'll be here tomorrow all day, but I have to head off. So, yeah, so, um, so yeah. yeah, we'll see you tomorrow. Bye for now. Bye. Bye.